Pick up the phone, I really need to talk with you Cause if you're not home, I wonder where you slept last night mm -hmm. Are you seeing someone new behind my back? Kiss another dude, it's for a little romance Pick up the phone, I really need to understand mm -hmm. Never had no trust issues Never had to break Good up. morning guys! What's up? I haven't done like a normal vlog in a long time. I've been doing the classroom thing, but I haven't done just an all day vlog like with no sense of direction as to where this is gonna go. I think I just phrased that so wrong. Um, let's see. I tried vlogging. I'm trying to catch you guys up and trying to see when the last time I even vlogged was. So, I feel like the last time I vlogged Liam got her? No, that's not true. I don't freaking know. Let's just start. Let's just start from scratch. I tried vlogging a few days ago. We went to the sunflower field like a typical basic family and it was a major fail because we're not a typical basic family. It did not go good at all. Um, I started to vlog for you guys so I'll insert that clip here. Hi guys haven't vlogged in a very 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 long time so I figured I would catch you guys up really quickly um what's the last thing that happened oh the last time I seen you guys Liam got stitches in his finger which over the week it got very 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 swollen and turned purple so I called the doctor and he went in he got his stitches on Saturday and then it was Thursday that I called the doctor and we went in and he said that it looked normal and there was no infection but he got his stitches out or stitch rather taken out on Friday yeah and today's currently Sunday so his stitch is out and he's healing well doing fine it's still swollen a little bit but not near as bad as it was oh what else is happening Oh, Allison's here, which I know a lot of you are new to my channel, so just a quick rundown. Allison is my best friend from home, and I say home because Ben, husband right here, is in the army, so we currently live in Kansas, but we're from Ohio. Allison lives in Ohio, but she drives to Kansas we quite often. Turn right onto Levy 27 Stillwell Road. She comes to Kansas to visit us. She's basically like the boys' third parent. So anyway, just to catch you up, his finger's healing. She's here visiting for the week and we're currently on our way to a sunflower seal. Sunflower. Sun. Take the next right onto Levy. Sunflower field. We have all three of the boys in the back. Ben, me, Allison's behind us. And we're a minute away from the sunflower field. It's so basic, but I'm so excited. So I guess I'll see you guys when we're there. We're excited. We came during sunset so that pictures would look better. Okay, that's all. See you soon. Bye. Bobby! No, you don't. Look, look, hey. It's so bright. This isn't working out for us. We think. Not a fan of the sun fields. It's too bright. It's not going well for us. Too, too bright. <laughs> okay, so we went to the sunflower field. Thought it was gonna be a success. Definitely wasn't. It was really hot. The boys didn't want to cooperate and we got some failed pictures basically. Insert here and here and here and here and here and wherever I decide to insert it. Um, insert them and let's see. So when I talked to you guys last, Allison was here. She unfortunately left us last, left us. She just like went back home. I said that like so dramatically. She went back to Ohio yesterday, so we're back here by ourselves. Um, oh, Liam's finger, I think I talked about in the other clip. It's healing nicely, the, like the top layer is just full dead skin, but I'm sure it will be just fine. It looks like it's healing fine other than that top layer. Um, the day we went to the sunflower field, Logan was acting really, really, really grumpy, and I couldn't figure out why. It turns out he was sick. Um, he had a fever that night, and then into the next day, he had like a 24 hour bug, and then the next day, Landon got the bug for 24 hours, and then the next day Liam got the bug for 24 hours, so I don't know what that was about, but they got over that quickly, so they were sick for the week. Um, what else happened the last week? Holy crap, I went um, to the school and picked up the boys' technology for the school year, which they officially start school on Tuesday, and this is currently Saturday, so 
I'm getting really anxious. I've uh, wanted to go in person to their orientation, but unfortunately they had to wear a mask and there was no exceptions, so they didn't get to go meet their teacher in person, so we did it via Zoom. Um, yeah, they'll be starting on Tuesday. They'll have therapy on Wednesday and I think maybe every Wednesday from here on out I'm not sure because I know it's a mess for us and it's probably gonna be like that for a little bit, but Well, buddy just to catch up. We had a productive productive morning. It's three o'clock Not sure what the rest of the day is gonna entail. We went outside for a little bit this morning, but it was scorching It's like a high of 91 today high of 94 tomorrow like where is fall not here. That's for sure Anyway, just wanted to catch you guys up. Everyone's well and starting to get back to a little bit of normal normalcy. Is that a word? Normalcy, yeah. So, I'm gonna charge my battery for a little bit because I haven't vlogged in days, but yeah, I still have a dead battery. And then when Ben gets home, he went to go get a monster. I need to go to the commissary and get diapers. You guys can come with me. Can you guys see how massive this grasshopper is? Holy, like, I'm not getting close because I'm not giving you that kind of representation, but it's massive, like massive, massive. Look at my camera, you guys, because it's so hot and humid. It's You can't see it because of the humidity, but 96. This is insane. Like my camera is, oh my gosh, it's so hot and humid. Okay, hi, change of plans. I was gonna just go to the commissary real quick, grab diapers, but I don't really like their brand or like the exchanges brand and they cost more than the Walmart brand and the Walmart brand is what we've been using for years so I'm like why waste more money on diapers I don't even like just so I can avoid leaving base so we are headed to Walmart which is fine anyway because there's a few other things I want to get so my mental list I was gonna say my mental list is completely mental my list my shopping list is completely mental so um, I just freeze because people look at me and it makes me feel weird but they're like old ladies that are probably like what the heck who is she talking to or they don't care at all um i need to get diapers and ben's drinking monster so now i want monster and i got the urge to bake so i'm going to bake chocolate chip cookies i think i've tried making chocolate choc cho bleh, i've tried making chocolate chip cookies before and i just suck at making cookies i don't know what the deal is i just I can't do it like they burn or I undercook them but there's a youtuber I watch her channel is called the wads and I love 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 her I'll leave her channel down below she makes chocolate chip cookies and she swears they're the best chocolate chip cookies in the world and she always talks about them and she uses like a pack of jello pudding mix which I'm pretty sure is vanilla I did not look and I never have my cell phone didn't bring it because I thought I was just gonna go down the road <sighs> so I think it's vanilla I hope it's vanilla if not that should be awkward um so we're gonna make chocolate chip cookies so i need chocolate chips and the pudding mix and everything else i have and it will be cheaper at walmart and what else was i gonna get oh so the boys on their iep one of their major goals for occupational therapy is to string beads and i stocked my room the classroom slash classroom like stocked it like crazy and I didn't get beads which is like their number one goal on their IEP for occupational therapy so I'm gonna grab beads I didn't know if the PX would have beads on base and if they did it would probably be a little bit for a lot of money so it just made more sense to drive the extra 20 minutes 15 minutes 10 minutes whatever it is to get to Walmart and then get the stuff a little bit cheaper and get everything I need so I think that's it plus I need milk for Liam and Cheerios milk oh my gosh see this is a mess i need to start writing stuff down milk cheerios monster diapers chocolate chips pudding beets i think that's everything when you see your best friend's vegan snacks in your car but she lives with her across the country ah, it's so sad come back I have an old person beside me and I'm parked in front of like where the employees come out to smoke cigarettes so we have a view from all around but it's okay. Um, I keep putting myself in these awkward positions so something wouldn't ring up at the cash register like at self-checkout because I always use self-checkout unless I have like $300 worth of stuff. 
and something wouldn't ring up which was already awkward for me because I know how to do it all I just it would not scan but eventually I got it after like literally like at least three minutes of trying to scan the same thing and then I was checking out and paying and then I realized that I forgot to get diapers like I was not because I only one side of our stores open at Walmart and I wasn't walking clear up the doors walking all the way around just to put myself like just because I have anxiety so I asked the cashier just to watch my cart for me and then I ran back and got diapers but so awkward and then I tried vlogging and a worker see me which is awkward so now here we are we have monster and I've been gone for an hour and Ben's probably like where the heck did you go also they didn't even have the Walmart brand diapers so it was kind of a waste to drive here we had to get loves but it's okay <laughs> off we go it's been a while and this is the roughest i may have ever looked on the vlog well that's probably not true but i look really rough right now it's currently 6 54 we sat outside for a little bit again and now we are back inside chilling everyone's had dinner well me and ben haven't but i don't think we're gonna the boys had dinner and now it's time for me to get them in the bath <sighs> I dread bathing all three of them. Liam's been getting a bath every day, but Landon and Logan, it's a rare occasion for them to get a bath, to be honest, because they freak out. If you've watched my past vlogs, you'll see that they freak out. I need to throw my hair back up because I look ridiculous right now. My hair, man. Whoa. Anyway, I'm about to get them in the bath. Ben is currently spray painting the desks. Apparently, I only got him spray paint to do one desk, and he's still priming and sanding. He hasn't even spray painted yet. So that could be a long process. Obviously, they're not all gonna get done tonight. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get them ready for bed. And then I think I'm gonna bake cookies and then call it a day. Yeah. <laughs> Put your sunglasses back on. Woo! you guys can see how cute it is it's like sparkly i guess that is why it's called metallic huh except for it won't focus because there's so many fumes in the air so cute the camera won't focus out here but apparently i only got enough spray paint to do a half of a desk quarter of a desk right three quarters of a desk so that's great. <laughs> Let me tell you, I got a wax today when I went to Walmart. What the heck is it? Oh, that wax. This wax, apple cider donut wax cubes. I just bought like a little dollar pack of it because I didn't know if I would like it. So this is like the third time I've smelled it in store and then today I was like, screw it, I'm just gonna get it. It's only a dollar. If I don't like it, then it's only a dollar. Um, it smells so, so, so good in here. I keep moving that wax warmer around my house. I should buy more of them. Um, it smells so, so, so good, which obviously these candles from Bath & Body Works are so expensive and I'll continue buying them. I just love them so much, but I'm out of another one after like a week and that smells almost stronger than this does and Landon's obsessed with smelling them so he's looking for it. No, no, okay, stinky. Anyway, try that. Um, apple cider donut, whatever I just called it. If you see it at Walmart, it's so good. Also, I'm sure most of you know, but a lot of people do it different ways. So this wax will like melt down to like there and then the rest won't burn anymore. I just take a spoon and scoop it out and then put it in my warmer instead of throwing it away. I know most people probably already know that, but that's what I do. I just use a spoon, put it in my warmers, and then you get like another week out of it if you put in the rest in your warmers. Love that, I've always done it. That's all, okay, bye. Stinky. Liam, are you cold? Are you cold? <laughs> Liam, come here. Can I see your finger? 
No, Bubby Stinky. You can see that like the actual cut healed really well, but that top layer of skin is just it's a goner. Oh yeah. Hey, you ready to go night night? Jammies are clean. Um, they're just stained really, really, really bad. Like my carpet, just stained really bad, but clean. Okay, one kid ready. Or well, Liam's down. Landon is all freshened up for bed, and now I just need to do Logan. I need to get them on a schedule because I don't know if I already said this, but they have to have school at a certain time every day. Last year we kind of just did it when the time was right for us, but now we have to like zoom during the day and they have school from 8.30 to 11.15. We're usually not even out of bed by 8.30. We're usually not out of bed till like nine. So our schedules need to change so much. They need to go to bed earlier. So I'm wanting to get them in bed by nine and it's 7.41. That way we can be up by like seven. That's like, 10 hours of sleep, which is plenty, but they won't fall asleep immediately. So if I get them in bed by nine, we'll be good. So we need to get on a schedule. Really, really need to get on a schedule and I really, really need to get it together. Okay, I'm gonna tidy up this kitchen. They're both all in their jammies and then tidy up the living room. And then it'll be time to bake these cookies. Okay, so what I'm about to show you is all that I had spray paint for, but like obsessed. Uh, and Ben said he didn't do the best job, but it still looks way better than this desk. Oh my gosh, my camera doesn't focus anymore. Ready? Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited once this table gets put on there. So cute. I think I made a good choice with the colors. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. That looks like it would be soft, but obviously it's... um not but holy crap I'm so 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 happy oh my gosh I these are the cutest things ever I wish I would have bought three that way Liam would have had one when he gets older but um it's too late now these things are long gone holy crap do the oh my gosh I'm so obsessed so obsessed but now that's all we can do <laughs> so cute oh, so cute okay I just spent like it was literally like 10 minutes I got it as cozy in here as it can possibly get. I need to put something on the TV to make it cozier. And then it stops to get, it's not that clean over there, but for here, oh my gosh, wired, 818. Okay. Hi guys, I finally flat ironed my hair at um, nine o'clock at night. I should have done this earlier, but here we are also. Put my PJs on, which are shorts and a t-shirt instead of leggings and a t-shirt. And we're gonna end this night by baking some cookies. Do you wanna bake with me? You wanna bake? Ow! You wanna help? Ow! Do you wanna help? Huh? You wanna help me? Eggs. Eggs? What's this? Whoa! What's this? No, heck no. This is butter. Butter. Do you know what this is? You know what this is? Chocolate chips. No. Apparently this is all it takes. Vanilla baking soda, pudding mix, two eggs, two sticks of butter, chocolate chips, and flour, which to me doesn't feel like enough liquid, but uh, we'll just trust the process, I guess. I lied, we also need brown sugar and then just plain white sugar. My bad. Flour, baking soda, butter, butter, brown sugar, white sugar, pack of vanilla pudding, two eggs, vanilla, flour, chocolate chips. Okay, they are on a sheet pan. Don't judge it. I know it's raggedy. I usually use foil, but we're out of it. This is my experimental sheet because I don't know if you're supposed to like 
press on them or keep them in a ball. I don't know if they're gonna spread now. So this is my experiment because we still have a bunch left. Oh, that looks so good. I definitely would have cut this recipe in half had I known it was gonna make that many because just like six cookies would have been plenty, uh, but I didn't know. So just so you know, there will probably be like 18 to 24 cookies, I would say, which is a lot, but that's okay. <laughs> They definitely rose a little bit, so I'm glad I flattened them. The chocolate chips didn't melt, but like, I swear every time I make chocolate chip cookies, the chocolate chips don't melt. Is that normal? Because I swear growing up when my grandma would make cookies, the chocolate chips would melt. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I think I did okay. Oh, I'm really, really stupid. I'm really, really freaking stupid. Like, really, 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 really stupid. <laughs> oh, they look so cute. But... Um, there's still 13 more in the oven, plus there's still that much left for probably four more cookies, I would say. The second tray is out. My sheet pans are very, 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 very raggedy, and I don't realize that until I go to film something. I do this every time. <laughs> okay, so my two pans, bam and bam, made 24, and then I put the last four in there which they don't smell too hot well they smell really hot that's the problem so I don't really know those ones might end up just being trash I don't know why they smell like they're burning but I'm assuming it's because I didn't wash the sheet before I put the new ones on I just buttered over the crumbs that were like stuck to the bottom because I suck at this stuff <laughs> hi last four done just realized it is currently 10 of three said I wanted my kids in bed by nine didn't know what time it was because the kitchen or the oven timer temperature thing was on, but cookies are done. Let's just take a moment. Don't even know if they taste good, but they look good. So let's just take a moment. because Ben made dinner as I was making these cookies, which was not very good, by the way. It was from Aldi. It was like a ravioli, but I had like mushroom spinach feta, I think, on the inside or some, I don't know what it was, but I didn't love it. Anyway, I'm gonna eat one of these cookies because I feel like I have to because we just made them and because I feel like I hyped them up, but I feel like I should get one that has a lot of chocolate chips in it. This doesn't really. It only has chocolate chips on the half of it. Okay, it's cold, but we're still gonna taste it. We'll see. And then I'll go give one to Ben and give his get his reaction. I'm nervous because I think it's just gonna taste like a cookie. Hmm. Well, first I wanna say I should have got semi-sweet chocolate chips instead of milk chocolate because these are very, 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 very sweet. But holy crap. Mm-hmm. It's so good. Oh, I have like a canker sore on the side of my mouth and right here, so it kind of hurts. I can't explain it. It's just so good. It kind of has like the texture to me of like a um like a pumpkin cookie because it's like kind of soft. I don't know if I undercooked them, but like, can you see how fluffy it is? I think that I like um overbeat it, or maybe this is normal because maybe this is normal because of the pudding, but it's pretty good. This is how <clears throat> I'll make chocolate chip cookies from now on. They're very cakey. If you like a cakey cookie, this is for you. If you don't, it's not for you. I don't think Ben will like it because he doesn't like cakey cake so we'll see all right i'm gonna eat this now i have a feeling ben will not want these but i'm gonna take them up to him anyway really really sweet i could only eat one but ben might want i don't know he probably won't eat all three of these but whatever let's go see what he thinks they're very good very 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 good definitely recommend i'll leave her the link to her video down below because i'm not taking credit for it i don't know if it's her video or somebody else's like recipe i mean um, but I definitely would not have come up with that on my own, but I will link her video down below where she has the recipe in it. Okay, that's all. They're very cakey. That's why. 
And they should still be a little bit warm. Is it good? It's like probably like my, oh, your chocolate chips are still like melty. Okay. But the chocolate chips are sweet. I should have got the other kind. Mm -hmm. I think that's like number two on my cookie list now. That's number one. Pumpkin cookies. Yeah. <laughs> I just said, I don't even know if you'll eat one, but I'll give them three and then you just ate one in like a bite. Well, I made 28 of them and I could only eat one. <laughs> okay. Bye. Have more. You're joking. How many do you want? Do you really want more? <laughs> Okay guys, I lied. I just got another one, but I definitely can't eat more than two and I know I'm gonna feel so sick after I eat this one. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. I'm not gonna vlog tomorrow, but if Ben works on the desks, I will keep you guys updated on that, but I'm just gonna take the day off to do boring stuff, you know. I think I'm gonna scrub the walls and do laundry, I'm thinking. Uh, I don't know, maybe, I don't I don't really know what's gonna happen tomorrow, but either I'm gonna take the day off and then come Monday, Labor Day, I will definitely vlog. So, with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Date, it's been like um, 10 minutes since I ended the vlog. Probably five. I have a toothache and I feel like I could throw up. Cookies were great, but just so much sugar. Definitely one and done. <laughs> okay, that's all. Now I'm drinking my weight and um, body water. Body water? <laughs> drinking my body weight and water. I don't even know what I'm saying. Okay, really? Bye, guys. You're far away and yet so close. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah, I feel that. Up in space, you're inside the